Today we have five artists competing to win $100,000. And I'm having them make art out of something ginormous. What's going on? They'll be making giant sculptures with 10,000 pounds of clay. That's huge! Wow. <laughs> but before I get to all that, <laughs> last episode, I put the artist in a sticky situation. It's like getting all over my fingers. It was one of our hardest challenges yet. <laughs> I didn't realize how tedious it was to put every little jelly bean in a straight line. But they all made it through. Today, nobody is going home. Oh my God. <laughs> but whoever loses in this episode will be eliminated from Instant Influencer. It's time for Instant Influencer with me, ZHC. Good morning, artists. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you all again. Zach, aren't you so happy you didn't send anyone home? Definitely, Dana. And I'm really excited to give you another opportunity. Thank you. <laughs> Zach has put us through so much. It's a fresh day, a new challenge, and the pressure is on because since he saved everyone last time, he's not saving everyone this time. We gotta bring it. <laughs> In order to be a successful influencer, it helps your brand to have a cool mascot. Huh, kind of like Dex. Yes. Dex logo and mascot. So dope. When I was growing my YouTube channel, I picked him to be my mascot because it was something personal to me. And I mean, look at him. Don't you guys think he's cute? Love him. Very cute. <laughs> All right, so today, artist, it's time for you to start building your very own brand mascot. Yes, okay. 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 Thank you. I should be able to look at this mascot and understand what your channel is all about. My YouTube channel has a wide range of videos from fashion to traveling to vlogs. I think Zach is an amazing artist and he is incredible at marketing his brand as well. I definitely want to put all these great tips to use to express my creativity and build my brand. Oh, by the way, Zach, you never even told me how they're going to make this mascot. So are they going to be drawing it? How is this going down? Wait right here. <laughs> Boy, where are you going? What's going on? Ooh. Okay. What in the what world? What in the world? <sighs> you can do it, Mr. Pack Mule over there. This is insane, Zach. That's <laughs> huge. Ten thousand pounds of clay. I'm so intimidated right now. Did you just say 10,000 pounds of clay? Yes. Artists, today you're going to use this 10,000 pound mound of clay to mold oh your mascot. My God. Wow. What? And artists, wow. I'm going to need an amazing video to show me how you made your mascot. My background is in graphic design, so I've made a lot of logos and mascots, but I've never used clay before, just Play-Doh with my kids at home. Artists, are you all ready for this? Challenge! You get five hours, and that time starts now. <laughs> this is perfect. This is crazy. This is the biggest mountain of clay I've ever seen. Uh, this is so tough. I'm gonna need tons of this. I'm the only one that hasn't won a challenge yet. So this is the challenge for me to kill it. Gotta go faster. I'm just gonna start sketching. I'm gonna be doing a night for my mascot. So I'm gonna start with a head sketch so I have the idea of how to sculpt his head and then his body. I want him to have a paintbrush sword and his shield would be a palette. Supporting and motivating other people is everything and I would love to show that through making my mascot a knight. I've never even worked with clay. I'm freaking out. I am gonna try to sculpt out my cat head out of this blob. Great. My mascot is gonna be my cat, Nami. She's actually gonna be sitting on a few law books. Just to, you know, describe my background, pursuing law school. And I also want her to look like me because Nami's the cat version of me. Okay, that looks like a cat so far, I think. Probably need to add ears. I need to sketch out this character. The whole point of this challenge is to brand yourself. So why not just go full in and live my crazy rainbow fantasy? I'm gonna be doing Magical gay centaur, because I'm a Sagittarius, and the symbol for Sagittarius is a centaur. And then obviously I have to do a unicorn, because it's me. <laughs> Clay is a little tough. You have to kind of like make it warmer with your hands. This is a lot different than Play-Doh. I feel like if you touch it too much, it's not gonna be smooth anymore. That Boston Rodeo is helping me out in 
insane. Oh, I couldn't imagine trying to do all of this without that. <laughs> Soften this clay up. What are you making, Sophie? This cool little bird that's gonna be sitting on a tree, a little peacock. I wanted to choose something that was really colorful and fun because I feel like that's kind of similar to my artwork style. And I also love nature, so I'm having it sit on this tree branch. Cool, put these inside. My kids would definitely do better at this than, than I'm going to do, but, but we will see. I'm making Enzo, he's a silverback gorilla, and I chose the silverback gorilla because they're very protective of their families. And I chose the name Enzo because it means home ruler, and that's definitely how I feel like it, with my four little gorillas at my house. <laughs> Ryan's actually doing a gorilla because he's built like when he's got the muscle. I'm 5'5", five five, real scary. <laughs> <laughs> Artists, three hours left. Those are pretty cool looking glasses, if you ask me. I feel like mine's gonna fall over. It keeps like kind of leaning, and I'm like, no, you're gonna stop that. Ryan, how are you doing? I don't really know how I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> to be <laughs> honest, it looks like my eight-year-old made it, so no. I'm hoping that I have enough time to make it look like my gorilla actually has some muscles. I'm definitely gonna try to focus most of my time on the video and the editing. I definitely feel like my art has been carrying me in this competition, and I need to prove that my videos can also be as great. This is taking too long. I need to hurry up. Making this night stand is definitely gonna be the hardest part here. So we have to try to find a way to make this night just stand up by itself. Stay like that, don't move. Okay. Oh my God, no. Oh no. My cape got destroyed. That's so not good. Wow. How's it going, Nick? It's a, I don't even know. My sculpture fell over and it cracked, so. No. I know, so now it's a bunch of rework. This is the first time I've ever had to sculpt anything and the cape is falling apart, the paintbrush is falling off. This thing is barely holding together. Stay there, buddy. Come on, buddy. Stay there, don't fall. Artists, two and a half hours left. Let's go. Sophie! Yes! Hey, girl! Hey, what's how up? are you? Oh, wow, this is so pretty. Thank you. I'm feeling really good about this challenge. I think I love how this is turning out. I put a lot of gorgeous. detail into the feathers. Thank mm -hmm, you. Mm -hmm. You know me. I'm always trying to help you guys out here. Yes. If you are choosing this as your mascot, this is yes. your brand. So, like, sell this story strong. Yes. You got this, girl. Thank you. What do you think? <laughs> Thank you. Nick. Yes. What's up? What up? <laughs> okay, Night of Art. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> is it? Yeah. I totally made that up, this but I like. Spot on. In this challenge, yeah. the most concerning you is? The sculpture itself. Okay. Learning how to use clay. I think the biggest thing for you to keep in mind with this is yeah. how can I get the art to be just as strong as my narrative? Totally agree. Okay, good luck, Nick. <laughs> Thank you, Dana. JB, hey. what's up? Hey, not much, not much. It's working my life away over here. Good. This is your moment to break out and really show him what you got. Yeah, my videos have been kind of all over the place and my story isn't being told. So I decided this time I'm gonna yeah. give myself five minutes, five minutes of that. Okay. Just really, this is what's gonna happen. This is what's gonna happen. You're storyboarding. Gonna happen. Exactly. Listen, you can do this. Thank you. I you feel good? It. Yeah, I feel good. I okay. feel confident. Good. <laughs> Bye, Nami. Yeah. I'll see you soon. Good luck. Yeah, thank Bye. you. I'm trying to loop like these little rings around the tail to try to make it look more like fur. Nice. And I think it's working. I think I'm going to paint my whole thing in a metallic silver. It gives it a nice shine. Some white so I can do her little name tag real quick. Oh, that is so cute. Everybody says she's fat, but she's not. It's just she has a few more pounds than other cats. Zach, I made this basketball out of clay. Let's play. Hang on. Jake, you're the backboard. Artists, it's time to take a break. David? Will it dribble? Yo, that thing is going to take my head off. Shoot. <laughs> oh. Guys! Oh my god. No! Oh. 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 
Layup and off the backboard. Oh. Shit! Oh. <laughs> Please get better. Hoops don't move. <laughs> oh, well, this one does. It's very, like, dry. It's just hard to work with. Yeah, it's, like, very hard to make it smooth. These details can make or break it. I must say, I am pretty impressed by the sculptures I'm seeing so far. If you have a good piece of artwork, it's all about how you show it on camera. So you're gonna wanna zoom up, get all the details, okay. get those nice shots to go over when you're talking about it. Yeah. Everyone looks great so far, but please consider moving on to your video soon. Anybody close to shooting? Not yet. No. <laughs> I feel like I'm going slow. I'm nervous for the video. I'm nervous about my sculpture. Smoothing out is torture. C-R-I-M-I-N-A-L. That would be embarrassing if I misspelled that. OK. She's sturdy. Wish me luck, y'all. I want to elevate the storytelling in my videos because I feel like I have the personality. I just need to be able to organize it in a way that's very engaging. I really want my video to be kind of a continuation of almost the painting challenge. Even more fabulous, higher energy. And I want to keep making Zach laugh. This is stressful. <laughs> yeah. Things heavy. At the least, yeah. <laughs> I'm sure that thing's <laughs> freaking weighs a ton. Holy <laughs> moly. Today, I'm going to show you more of Planet David and the magical mascot that represents my art identity, my art brand, and all this crazy, colorful, magical land I have created. Let's get into it. How are you doing on time, Nick? I think I'm doing good. I think I'm going to get ready to shoot and edit right now. It gets intimidating when people start leaving. <laughs> right? <laughs> It already fell once, and if it falls again, it's pretty much over. Please don't fall, please don't fall, please don't fall. Okay, buddy, just me and you. Slow and steady, slow and steady. I'm just walking with it, it's rocking back and forth. Careful. Oh, thank God. Woo! Man, there in one piece. So I'm finally done with my mascot, and now it's time to storyboard. That might make my story flow a little bit better, because I know Zach is having some issues with where I'm trying to come from with the videos that I'm producing. I'm sitting on the floor over this because, I don't know, the floor is where I get most of my inspiration. I've got the time lapse here. I have tons of that footage. I'm gonna look goofy doing all of this footage, but it's fine. Hope you like the new logo, and I hope you like Enzo, my... I need to write it down. I'm definitely feeling the pressure, so I'm going to need to write down exactly what I want to say in my intro and my outro. That way I can make sure I get everything in it. So this really brings a piece of my childhood into... So this piece holds value to me that... I've learned that one of the unique things about me is that I talk to myself. So any kind of insight that my mind is telling my hands to do when I'm actually working is just going to be JJ number two. Taking forever. Please, give me a second. Yo, make sure you get those glasses in. You're right, glasses are a really great idea. You know what you should also do? You should put some law books, because, you know, we almost were thinking about law school, right? This looks so weird, but I promise it'll come together. Do a couple more photos so I have them. That looks so good. Oh, that's gonna look dope. Oh, no, my God. <laughs> Woo! That was almost... Way worse than it already is. We need that piece back. I'm just hoping my video doesn't fall apart like my mascot is. Stay there, don't fall. Oh God, look at his fingers. We cannot afford another accident. We almost completely ruined my sculpture. Oh, okay, back to square one. No one's editing yet. This video has to be fire. I'm the first one to go editing, so I am starting to feel confident right now. You filmed, JB? Oh, uh, yeah. You were fast. I just had to do a little snippets, you know? Did you film an intro and an outro? Yeah. Oh my god, yes, JB. Yeah, I know. We got time. I have a lot to work with. This should be good. How's your going? Pretty good. I just, like, have to cut out a lot because I always, like, mess up my words. <laughs> yeah. We got this, we got this. Yeah. Let's go back. Uh, let's catch a little bit of that. Oh my god, I took so much footage, I want to vomit. This is a lot of stuff. I got that too much gene. 
and it keeps messing me up a little bit. So I think I might have planned almost too much. 70 videos. I need to get this done. Oh my God, it's taking so long. I think I'm gonna be able to get this finished. I'm trying to make sure that I get everything added in that Zach had given me critiques on. Oh, yes, this is it, this is it. Oh my gosh, my Final Cut Pro just quit. Okay. Did you save? Yeah, thank God. Just as a friendly reminder, save as you go. Save as I go. I'll probably cut this last part all together, to be honest. <laughs> this is making me laugh. I'm feeling amazing. This is gonna be an awesome video. Oh man, this is interesting. Oh, come on, computer. Your device ran into a problem and needs to restart. My computer just is restarting. Oh, no. That's all messed up. <laughs> You've definitely been saving? Yeah. At 218. Oh, my God. <sighs> I think her computer might have crashed. It was 30 minutes ago, and I did so much. I thought you were saving as you go. Uh, I thought I was, too. This is not happening. I have nothing. <laughs> I hadn't been saving. I literally have like the first. <sighs> JB's freaking out and I feel so bad. I hope that she can pull this off. Control S, that's all I had to do. Control S would have saved my video. I can't believe that. But now it's all gone. I am freaking out. Figure it out, figure it out. I'm trying not to cry because I still have a task to complete. I'm not gonna give up. I'm gonna put something out there. Artists, 10 minutes. You gotta play something in the background of this one, that's for sure. I think everyone really wants to prove themselves this time. Mm -hmm. I mean, whoever you choose, it's gonna be the top four. So stakes are higher than ever. I need to find a sound effect to use right here. Yes. I'm gonna be right at 60 seconds. There's too much to put in. One minute! Oh my god. Okay, hold on. <laughs> right, let's see if this transition is good. That's it, that's all I have time for. Five, four, ah. three, ah. two, one. Time's up. <laughs> ah. <sighs> Feeling good. That was so fast. I'm very. Very, very nervous for Zach to see this. Oh, it's so hot. Okay, artists, you all had five hours to invent, design, mold your mascots, and make a video. <laughs> Dana? Hold on a minute. Jake, bring out today's special guest. Artists, I want you to meet my friend, Lele Pons. So excited! Lele Pons has accumulated over 4 billion views on YouTube with her humor and talent as a singer. I love your throne. <laughs> I do not come like this anywhere. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Oh my god, every single time that I go on stage, I need to pee. <laughs> that throne was a nice touch. Yeah, I came up with it right now. All of it. <laughs> yeah. All me. All me. <laughs> okay, shall we get into it? Yes! yes. I'm so excited. <laughs> We're so excited to see your finished products. Yes. Nick. Yes. You're up. Woo. It's time to see your mascot video. Let's do it. Guys, today we're using polymer clay to sculpt my new and official Nick's Heart mascot. First thing we need is clay. Since I'm sculpting a knight, I'm gonna start out with gray clay for the armor and then go over it with an iridescent silver paint the reason why I'm sculpting a knight is because I graduated high school as a Holy Cross knight, and it really just taught me integrity, motivation, and to really be kind to others and motivate others. I know that's corny, but that's just the truth of it. This is my first time ever sculpting anything. Here's the reveal. Nick, that video was hot spit fire. Hey. It was crazy. <laughs> it was so good. Ah, thank you. I find you really entertaining. 
Thank I you. I think I'm starting to see your personality come through in the videos a little bit more. You even have like weird quirky bits where you're like showing your eyes and like smiling in the corner. I absolutely love that. Those are like little Easter eggs your audience will latch onto and be like, hey, that's Nick. He does those kinds of things. So for the art, I thought your mascot was pretty cool. I liked how it tied into your past. I would have liked to see a little bit more texture on the mohawk and the paintbrush. I think it would have made your piece a lot stronger. Yeah, for sure, yeah. I wanna know why, why that posture. Yeah, um, <laughs> um, I mean, he's just a laid back dude, but he, uh, <laughs> no, he just, it, honestly, he couldn't stand up by himself. So the cape is like one of the only things holding him up. You're very likable. You know? Yeah, great smile also. You're very likable. I have a boyfriend, I'm not flirting. No. <laughs> but you're very likable. Um, the only thing I would say is that I would have loved a goodbye from you. Thanks, I, I agree with you. <laughs> yeah. Good job, Nick. Thank you, Dana. <laughs> Good job, Nick. Killed it. Yeah. David Darling, you're up. Go, David. Let's see that mascot video. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing completely amazing today. I made a mascot and I can't wait to tell you more about it. So Twinkerbell is a mix of two things. It is a take on Tinkerbell and also Twink. They are part unicorn, part human. And this character in general is a stance of power. I think so much of our time is wasted when there's taboo and there's shame and there's hate. And this character is here to stop all of that through the use of art making and love making. This special arrow has the power to not only have people fall in love with one another and to become more loving and more open to new ideas, but it also inspires them to go make some boss ass art. And I really feel like Twinkerbell is the way to roll peace, honey. <laughs> I feel like this really represents what I want to do as an artist. Give someone a big sloppy kiss for me. Have an amazing rest of your day. <laughs> David, amazing sculpture. I love it. I think it's so on brand. I see all the pink, the rainbow. It, it really screams David. For the video, I found it quite entertaining. Thank you. And I love your storytelling. You're talking about your piece. You're bringing the entire story together. You were talking about being accepted, and I feel like a lot of people are going to resonate with that. Thank you. I think you continuously show more layers of your brand. I think you did a really good job on the art. Did the video cut off, like, abruptly? Yeah, I had to cut it at the 60. I would work on that. I think mm -hmm. endings of videos are very, very important. Yeah. I know you want to put everything in there. You have to delete one thing. Right. You know? But right. you are so entertaining. Oh, thank and you. And I feel like your art piece is so incredible. Is, are those strings? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how you did that, <laughs> but it's very creative. I love the colors. I love that it matches your hair. Yeah, you know, it always. You <laughs> are someone that, that catches my attention and I want to see over and over again. Let's be best friends. Yes. yes. <laughs> Let's see Come to Miami. Yes. <laughs> Come to Miami. Thank you so much, David. Thank you. Yeah. Sophie, you're up next. Sophie. Hey, everyone. Today, I'm going to be showing you my lovely mascot here. I decided to go with this beautiful peacock because everyone who watches my channel knows I love bold colors and I think this is one of the most colorful animals there is. I think these birds are so majestic and in my hometown they used to run around wild. I was always so fascinated by them. I would pick up the feathers that they would shed around and just make art with them. So I feel like it really just embodies me as a person because I feel like sometimes I can be a little bit quiet at first until I open up and show my true colors. I hope you all enjoyed taking a look at this piece and I'll see you next time. I enjoyed your music choice. It fit the vibe of calm, nature, yes. soothing. <laughs> and the art piece is just outstanding. Thank you. I agree. This is an animal that has a lot of details and it's very hard to make. I love that you not only did the animal, you did the tree. You put a little extra in there. The video is very entertaining. I love that we saw how you made it. I'm someone that obviously came from Vine and those six, for me, 60 seconds is amazing because I had only six <laughs> seconds. So it's okay to like slow down, try to not make so many cuts like go back to back. But mm -hmm. I very much like that you were very deep explaining why you chose the peacock. Thank you. For your video, I think you're doing a better job putting B-roll over you talking, but I think you just need some pans, some zooms, just something to make it a little more interesting so it's not just a still shot. But otherwise, I. I loved it. Beautiful art piece. Great job. Thank you. Yeah. Okay.
Okay, JB, you're next. Show us your mascot video. Let's go for it. Hey guys, hey. it is JB. Wait, why are both of us here? Why are you here? You're supposed to be manning the camera. Anyways, we have a cool surprise for you. We're about to reveal my mascot for my channel. Let's see how it goes. Are you done yet? It's taking forever. I really need you to stop talking because I really need to work and this is taking a very long time. So please, give me a minute. Oh, That's all that we have for you guys today. Let me know what you think about Nami in the comments and if we should add anything else to her. God, I'm so mad. JB, I'm really impressed with your sculpture this video. I think this is the best work you've brought this entire competition in terms of the art. Thank you. I really loved how you had those little detailed glasses. I would have cleaned up the books just a little bit, but other than that, I think the sculpture was phenomenal. I appreciate that, thank you. For your video, Dana and I did see that you had some technical difficulties. Do you want to tell me a little bit about that? Um, I was actually about 90% done with my video when the computer crashed. Sometimes you just space on saving, so. I understand this, it's happened to me before. Yeah. It's so hard, sometimes you don't save it, it's the worst feeling, but it, it happens. There was one time I edited for over 20 hours. My computer ran out of battery. When I opened it back up, everything was gone. So lesson for everyone, save your work in case your computer crashes. Sooner or later, it's gonna happen. The good thing is that you came into this specific challenge with a plan. You've never done that before. No, no. You pivoted and you still were able to present something. So I think you should be really happy that you yeah, did that. Thank you, I appreciate that, thank you. I've edited it. A lot of videos. I don't even know how you did the split. I just learned that like two weeks ago, so. <laughs> I, I've never done that. I've never done that before. And I think it was brilliant. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Yay! Okay, Ryan, you're up. Go, Ryan. Here we go. Hey, what's up, everyone? Ryan with Arm Designs again, and I've got something super special for you. So let's get our aprons on and get started. All right, much better. Today, I had to make my mascot, and this could literally win me $100,000. So let's get into it. All right, as most of you know by now, I'm a huge family guy. So this is why I chose a silverback gorilla to be my logo. Just like me, silverback gorillas are huge on family, and their main job is to protect them. All right, thanks everyone for checking this out. Uh, my new logo, Enzo. I will be dropping my new merch next month, so check in the description below. And I definitely hope that this was enough to get me to that chance where I could win $100,000. Don't forget to go down and hit that subscribe button, because every time you hit the subscribe button, you'll feed one of my four gorillas that I have at home. Thanks, guys. See you next time. Oh, <laughs> Ryan, um... I thought your sculpture was nice. The face was kind of creative, cartoonish, looks pretty aggressive, but I do think there's something funky about the arms. The proportions seem a little bit off, but Ryan, this was probably one of your best videos. Awesome, thank you. I really liked how you were bring your humor out, bring your family into it so that the audience has a little bit more of a personal connection with you. I feel like you have grown so much. I've been listening. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you are just really soaking up Zach's feedback. You said, okay, music, you want music? You got music. You want transitions? I got transitions. Like all these things, yes. but the amount of text, I wonder if it's too much. Yeah, I kind of put a lot in. However, to me, it felt like this is the video that you had the most fun with. Is that true? Yeah, I had a lot of fun with this one. I felt it. I felt the fun. <laughs> Good. I think that the video is incredible. You have a, you had charisma. Thank you. Ryan, great job. Thank you. Really nice. Good job, Ryan. Yeah. Artists, come on up. That was literally a big challenge. Yeah. You all did such yes. a great, great job. How are you guys feeling? Terrible. 
Nervous. <laughs> oh, man. My stomach every single time. You guys are so talented. Thank you. Thank you. You should be very proud. Yeah. Artists, you all did incredible today, but unfortunately, there's still going to be one person going home today. Y'all know the deal. So please go back to your video labs, and Lele and I are going to chat with Zach, and Zach will be to you shortly. Good. Good luck. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate you guys. Bye. They all put out such great pieces of work this time. I'm so happy. I don't make the final decision right now. Thoughts on Nick? So I, I liked his editing a lot. Yeah, I feel like Nick is one of the most entertaining artists we have, but sometimes he could pay a little more attention to detail, kind of like the textures, the pose. Mm -hmm. Now we have Sophie. Sophie's peacock was absolutely incredible. I loved her description. Why the peacock? She said that she was shy, and it's like showing her true colors with this. Yeah, I think just the video's a little hard to watch through. David is someone that I would love to watch, and I love that he's so different. Like, everybody did, like, things we know that exist. What he created doesn't exist, you know? <laughs> and I love that he was like, I'm just gonna make my own thing. Overall, I think he's really bringing each video and art piece to the next level. Uh, what are your thoughts on Ryan's? Ryan's art piece was my least favorite. Yeah, definitely. The art piece was lacking a little bit this time. I love that Ryan is starting to expose his personality more. Every time we give him a little bit of feedback or critiques, he puts it into the next one. So every video, he's finding a way to make it better. The one piece of advice I would have liked to tell him earlier is just don't get to the point where you overdo it. OK, so JB. I loved her mascot, mm -hmm. but her video wasn't done. I wish I saw the whole video, because I think she would have been there with Nick. There's something to be said about her ability to pivot and to still show something. It was a hard decision to make. Well, thank you, Lele, for your input. I, I really appreciate you coming out. It was It's hard. It's really hard, because they're all so talented. Dana, once again, I'll see you next time. I'll see you next time. <laughs> <sighs> I'm gonna go make more decisions. Hey, David. It's Hi. me, Zach. I have something to tell you. You are safe. You did an amazing job with the video. Incredible work. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Come out to the lounge. <laughs> Sophie, your peacock was absolutely incredible. You and your peacock are safe. Yay! Oh my gosh. What's up, Nick? Oh, what's up, Zach? I have some news for you. Your night was great. Your video was incredible. I loved it. <laughs> Nick, you are safe. Ah, thank you. I'm going to the lounge. Top four. <laughs> Semi-finals. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 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 What's up? Oh, oh, we're hugging now. Yeah, we're, hugging. we're on that level, um. right? I am so not ready to go home. I'm heartbroken. I'm very, very heartbroken, and I'm not ready to go home. I got pretty good feedback. It was a lot better than I was expecting. But I know I don't have a finished video. I want, so to, I want to see them both walk out. And I know, right? Zach's Can we like, have oh, both? you know, no one's going home again. I know, literally. <laughs> like, what? What's up? Oh my gosh. What's it going? What's going on? Wow. This is the four. This is the four, Jamie. Congrats, guys. Four. Semi finals, bitches. <laughs> yeah. Semi finals. Wow. I'm gonna miss JB, though. Yeah. Team Pride. <laughs> hey, JB. Hey. Can I sit down? Yeah, of course. Ah, <sighs> okay. <sighs> well, at the end of the day, the video just wasn't finished, so yeah. we're gonna have to send you home. 
But I just wanted to say how impressed I was with your art piece. The cat sculpture was incredible. Thank it, it you. Was, I'm so proud. And I'm so sorry to hear about your technical difficulties. Yeah. Technical stuff happens sometimes. I would suggest you keep making these videos. You're going to go places. Do you want to tell the people watching this where they can find you on YouTube? Just my name, so at Janisha Brown. Would you like to sign off with me? This is Zach. This is JB. And this is Instant Influencer. See ya. See ya. I give you a hug. Yeah. Oh. This journey has been incredible. This right here is not the end. I have so much more. I have so much content I want to create for everybody. So save your stuff, guys. Save your stuff. <laughs>